The next form is the sampling record. We'll come back to that again. We've already completed um, most of section one. I'll fill in the lake name and county and date. Um, now we go to section two, which is the Secchi disc reading. So to do the Secchi disc reading, you'll take out the Secchi disc. Okay, and you're gonna lower that over the side of the boat. Does it matter which side? Um, you should do it on the shady side of the boat. And you can see we really don't have any um, glare on the surface, so you can lower it over either side of the boat. So why don't we lower it over this side of the boat? Um, if you're wearing polarized glasses, which you're not, you want to take those off to make sure that that doesn't um, create uh, extremely high water clarity measurements that might not be consistent from one person to another, since most people don't use polarized lenses. Um, so you're going to lower the disc down um, as far as you can until you cannot see any part of the disc, and you're going to record that depth. Four. Okay, so 1.4 meters. We'll mark that on the sound and the sampling record. Now that you're going to take the disc down a little bit further, at this point you can't see it anymore, but we want to just confirm that we can't see it anymore. Okay. And then we'll start bringing it back up slowly. When you can first see it again, when it first reappears, we'll record that depth as well. Those two measurements should be within a half a meter of each other. If they're not, then you'll want to repeat those again. And it may not be because you're, you might be out on a day where there's a lot of wave action or a lot of glare, um, and we want to try to minimize that as much as possible. So if you don't get those two measurements within a half a meter of each other, you'll want to take those again. It was 1.4 meters both going down and coming back up. So Secchi reading one and two or 1.4. And we, DEC, will average those two numbers to get the Secchi disc measurement. The only other thing that we need to note on the form is, is the disc sitting on the bottom when you're actually looking at it? That wasn't the case here, so we'll circle no for both of those.